y'all, this is actually coming to you live from the hot tub. Snake River, one spot, and it's a grand day, and it is Co-Wetzel Day. Co-Wetzel Day, and you're actually from where? Highway 30 Music Fest. Atta boy. Hey y'all, this is Gordy from Highway 30 Music Fest. Coming to you where else, Asher? Live from the hot tub. Snake River, pulling spot, hot springs. We're in the grande. We big old boy. As Asher told you, it is Coetzel Day. And if you don't know what that is, maybe you're not as big a Coetzel fan as you thought you were. So maybe you should look that up a little bit. Coetzel Day. February 28th, 2016. You want to correct, Megan? Okay. So if you're a Coetzel fan, look that up. But there you go. So anyway, y'all, hope you're having a happy fun day Sunday. Uh, we had a great time last night down at Juan San Cotos again uh, for having the beautiful Sage uh, Albrecht. Um, Sage, as you know, is our uh, assistant of all things at Highway 30 Music Fest now and is doing an amazing job. Plus, she sing sing. And uh, Megan went live on some things and uh, uh, you got to hear her a little bit. And uh, great night and great job, uh, Sage, and great to meet your whole family. She had family who came up from Texas, Utah, all parts, and uh, packed house. Uh, the Kodos uh, team did a great job. Um, uh, the food was amazing. I'm guessing the, the beers and Prosecco and everything you all were drinking was amazing. Um, it was. My iced teas and lemonades, uh, my own Palmers were, uh, were great. So yeah, anyway. Matt Westerman said, LOL, hell yeah. Already been to Taco Bell. Atta boy. Matt knows exactly what we're talking about. Atta boy. And hopefully you were sober enough to get to Taco Bell in the morning, Matt. But that, that's great. And I wonder why Taco, if Taco Bell uh, doesn't understand why they're absolutely slammed today, maybe they ought to become Cole Wetzel fans. So uh, there you go. There you go. So great Megan Gallivan said, happy Sunday. Happy Sunday, Sunday, Megan. And uh, thanks for buying your tickets. Plus, we're going to put you to work. You know that. But we'll figure something out. Maybe to upgrade those and go from there. Lacey Lothmiller said, Happy Sunday, family. Lacey, happy Sunday to you. Hopefully it's uh, good over on that side of the canyon out there. It's beautiful over here. Just a little bit of wind. But a bluebird day. Uh, early this morning when I was putting the gear away, I saw there was already guys out on the golf course like before night. Mm -hmm. uh, so they're getting at it. So <coughs> we've got some birthdays. And uh, got some pretty, uh, as always, but we've got some pretty amazing people on this weekend's birthdays. And so we're going to get into your uh, birthdays. How about that? So, first of all, the man, the myth, the legend, uh, the little pumpkin himself, Craig Wren, Craig Budman. Uh, been with us since day one, known him a long, long time. Worked with his mom years ago at the airport, but Craig yeah, runs our beer garden. Uh, also part of the watching distributing team and I'll tell you what Craig happy birthday and it is your birthday today uh, which is awesome um, yeah happy, <laughs> there you go happy birthday also now Sergeant Rock Shane Rock has a birthday today also uh, Shane Rock if, if you're looking and you're not knowing actually what to do the career Shane is an Idaho National Guard recruiter if you want to go full time he can, he can hook you up Shane's been serving our country a long time he also brings the kids on uh, from the Idaho National Guard. They have paintball. They had uh, some badass equipment there. And it's, it's southern Idaho. The wind's picking up, so hopefully you can still hear me. So happy birthday, Shane. Glad to have you on board again. And then we have birthday, Keaton Wright, the man keeping the beat with Jesse Dane and the Sagebrush Drifters. Uh, you can see them playing. Uh, I think they got another gig coming up in the Boise Valley at uh, the Steakhouse, uh, Indian Creek Steakhouse. For Keaton Wright, happy birthday to you! And then uh, you've seen him on the, and you see Keaton on the Highway 30 stage, but you've also seen this man on the Highway 30 stage, keeping the, keeping the beat with the stand-up bass. Old Scott Nichols of. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Nick Sterling and the Nomad. There you go. Got too many names <laughs> going in my head. But Scotty, happy birthday to you, brother. Hope you're having a great one. And then one of our biggest all-time fans, the sharpest dressing man in Idaho, John Daniels. John Daniels, happy birthday to you, brother. Our, one of our, our almost biggest fans, sharp dresser. Love this man. 
great dude. Uh, John Daniels, happy birthday. I know it's this week, though, right? It's one of the days coming up, but John wanted to wish to give you a special shout out today. Hope you're having a good one, brother, and I'm sure I'll hit you up on your birthday. And then uh, Molly Hamilton, uh, part of the Highway 30 family. She's given a lot of haircuts, uh, been part of us before she was married. Now she's married into the Farmers Bank clan. And uh, Molly, we love you and uh, uh, hope Uncle Jack's doing well. And then the man who used to keep the beat, and isn't this just so, you know, it all kind of hits that Dre has a birthday on February 28th. And those of you who know this little bit of story about February 28th was maybe Dre's birthday party have something to do <laughs> with it being co Wetzel Day and the whole song and the things that happened and this and that. So uh, uh, Dre uh, used to drum for uh, years and years for co Wetzel. Now he's uh, herding cats for them, uh, managing and road managing and taking care of them. And boy, I wouldn't want that job. But I love that team. And I'm going to be seeing those boys in about, what, 10 days, mate? Uh, 10 days, I'll be down in Texas uh, seeing Cole Wetzel, Hardy, and uh, Sundance Head, Aaron Lewis. Yep. A bunch of them going to be going. So uh, super excited about that. So if any of you are down there, hope to, hope to run into you. I think I hit uh, Texas soil on the 9th. So I, I got Idaho's weather let back into Idaho. And it crawled back in here because uh, somebody left the damn gate open and it got loose down in Texas. So I uh, want Texas to have their weather back and get things warm back up and I'll be down to see y'all very soon. So uh, if you have a birthday this week, if you had one last week, you have one coming up this month, this year, happy birthday to you. Lacey Lothmuller says Peyton's birthday is on Saturday. Coming up, Peyton, happy birthday to you. Uh, happy, happy birthday coming up next Saturday. That's awesome. I'll bet your mom will make you a beautiful cake. Cherish Wilson said, ah, the countdown to Highway 30 is getting closer. Can't Absolutely. wait to get there. Cannot wait, Cherish, Cherish. Uh, it's going to be awesome. And if you notice, what we're going to do here a little bit different, we're going to play, uh, we're going to pick uh, someone to sing a few more, or play a few more songs in the hot tub. And if y'all haven't caught who that is, uh, I think five or six of these first songs played up. Maybe I'll go along with that. Maybe I can keep it short. Are going to be Morgan Wade. And uh, man, she is badass. So that's who's playing over uh, quite a few of her different songs. Go, Meg. Kathy Compton said, Happy Sunday from the Comptons. Josh is driving us to post church fried chicken. Ah, oh, fried. Damn it, Josh. Fried chicken. One of my favorites all time. Um, love the Comptons and uh, pre-church fried chicken. We're having a little bit of church right out here in the hot tub. And then we're going to be heading over. I know Josh is going to be jealous of this. We're going to be heading over to J.P. Mains and picking up a few knives and maybe a couple other things. Hope your mom doesn't check how much money I've got before I go over there, Asher. <laughs> it can get crazy. But anyway, uh, speaking of that, if you didn't see my post, J.P. Mains, uh, he's from Idaho. He's over at Cal Support, originally from Murtaugh. Uh, he builds some amazing stuff. If you're looking for a one-off, one-of-a-kind knife, uh, he can build it for you. He can put a, a sheath on it for you. Uh, his wife can build you a beautiful display box. Plus, they do some other amazing, amazing things. You need to go on and, and like J.P. Mains. I'm going to try to talk him into having his own, come up with a Facebook just to have all of his knives and stuff on because this man builds amazing stuff. Just built a custom knife for Johnny Manziel. Uh, down there, Texas A&M boy, um, and, but he builds a lot of outstanding, amazing things, and he's one of our own right here in Idaho, and uh, be watching also as we're going to be talking about a few little things, and it's, uh, help me out with the first part of that, for hope, hope for, and then I think it's Anna or Anna, A-N-A, uh, his big girl, and uh, we're going to be, uh, be watching as some more cool things come up for that. There will be some custom pieces by JP that we'll be donating back to that nonprofit at the birthday party bash. So that's badass. And also be watching as he's got all kinds of ideas. Hell, he's a part of the skillet just like me and has got a ton of great ideas and things that we can come up with and do and some one-offs and some cool things. But if you're looking for something awesome, him and his wife do amazing things. So go look at, go look up his page, JP Mains. Um, check him out. You'll have to like him or having whatever friend to like you. friend yeah, except you but anyway so there we go um also sudden cool coming up 
We saw live music last night and everybody got on me. Hey, we need some more music. We need some music. So bada boom, bada bang. Uh, tried to figure some things out. We got some things figured out. Who's a Sam Riggs fan? Are you a Sam Riggs fan? No. Yes. Is that a hell yes or just a yes? Hell yes! So, got a hold of Sam Riggs. <laughs> got a hold of our team at the Historic Turf Club. And we got a date. March 26th. Now, tickets will be out later this week. We're going to do some tables, some VIP tables. Uh, even talk to Sam. Some of the tables will have signed lyric sheets on them. Uh, there will be tables of four. Um, and there also will be a few. Do not do I have? A, do we have a few singular seats too, Megan, that people can get? Yes. But now, we are, it's limited number, as you all well know. So, um, when they come on sale, you're going to have to pop them and get them. Our great friends at Squad Up are working on it, and you'll actually be able to go in and pick your table. Okay? Um, Joel Wright said, oh, hell yes. Oh, hell yes. So, so there you go. If you want an upfront table, get a hold of us. or just seats. Well, they're going to come out on the website. Yep. But it, people, when they come on, they're going to go fast. I'm guessing it'll be Wednesday, Thursday, East, but we'll let you know. We will let you know. And any of you who are on the email list, you'll get an email of when they're, right? Are we going to do that probably? Yep. Okay. So that'll, that'll be, so uh, be watching for that. Now, um, Sam's super excited. He's got a lot of new stuff. And uh, there's probably going to be a couple of, you know, a couple other little surprises in there. Some other music. Uh, just got to work something out. Maybe Sage will be singing a couple songs. And if she's not booked, maybe Ellie May and her new uh, band. You heard that right? Band. Uh, she drug out some, uh, drug some people out of retirement and uh, put them back to work, and uh, it's going to be a great time. So be watching. But it's at least going to be Sam, and then we'll do some other things. March 26th, which is a Friday, uh, we will be. If you're needing to travel, we'll be setting up um, with Holiday Inn Express some deals on tickets. And as of right now, that's the only show we have, you guys. I'm, uh, I'm trying to work on some other things. Trust me. But it's been tough. So, Jaylene asked if it's also kid friendly. It is kid friendly, absolutely. Talk to Donnie and the whole gang. Now they will have to have a ticket because we're limited seating. Okay, but you can buy a table and they can more than welcome to sit there. Uh, they're going to have some uh, uh, finger foods and different things. But absolutely, it is going to be um, kid friendly. Uh, so, and uh, I have a feeling the upfront tables are going to go first, um, but. They're not a bad seat in the house. Uh, we went over and reconfigured it, and uh, like I say, very limited, limited number of seating. But as soon as those are out, get on. You can pick your table, pick your seats. Uh, the VIP at this time, anything marked VIP table, will have a lyric sheet on it. So uh, there's that. Signed by Sam. Absolutely. That's pretty badass, right? She has also asked what's price of table and also individual seats. Those are all going to be released. I, I, those yep. will be, we're getting all that figured out. We're keeping it as, uh, that'll be released in a couple days. We're keeping it as uh, very affordable as we can. Uh, the VIP seats are a little bit more, but uh, it, it'll be affordable. I promise you that. And uh, doing the best we can. So those, uh, those numbers will come out on um, Hope and Wednesday. That, that'll, be, that'll be released. We'll give you time, and you can just get on and run. Uh, but I think, isn't there some table of four tops under 200? I mean, did we do I think so. Yeah, I think there's some tables under 200. There's a little over 200. I mean, just all different things. But it's four good seats. The VIP, the, the area on the dance floor there will have your own waitress and stuff. So we're keeping them very as affordable as we can, y'all, to get things done the way we, ha we have to do it. So... Uh, how do I get on the email list? Answer. Go to our web page. Go to our web page and it will uh, okay. it'll tell you how to sign up. The minute you go to www.hwy30musicfest.com and uh, click on it and uh, it'll ask you a couple times in there to sign up for the email list. Yep, it should and pop right up. And a lot of good info. A lot of good info. Yep, there's no airplane flying up there. It's going really fast. So, uh, also, so the Sam Show coming up March 26th. Now, this week, you're going to see on tomorrow some info come out about the Alumni Association, the Highway Dirty Alumni Association. 
and and everything is going to go live on the fifth. Now, what is this alumni association about? This alumni association is about once it all gets up and running, you're going to be able to get some very special gear. Um, it gets you. Uh, it has three different packages. Uh, the first package has like a T-shirt. Help me out, Meg. T-shirt, koozie, uh, stickers, a lifetime card, and some other things. Plus, and then it goes all the way up into an ultimate package, uh, which includes everything, plus a one-of-a-kind, almost like, well, they are, the Jocelyn's Letterman jackets. And I'm making them very affordable, y'all. I'm telling you what, I'm making, not making a dime. I just want people to be part of this. Plus, you get a lifetime 20% off of our uh, Gordy's Gear dot com dot com because uh, you'll get in on that plus you will get you will always get you'll be offered some if you're a member of that you'll be offered some uh, special tickets to the music fest that only you can get uh, discounted tickets there'll be a limited number of those that will be available to you plus if you're that member you will have a fast pass haha <laughs> at highway 30 music fest you get a check in at a little bit different area and each day of Highway 30 Music Fest, you'll get in about a half hour earlier than anybody else. Now, do you go into the main venue? No. Can I have a special little building set up for you where there will be some refreshments? It'll be around 10, 30, 11 o'clock before everything gets going. And there will be at, one, at least one artist a day. Somebody in that lineup will be in there doing a special meet and greet for y'all. And maybe do a song. Plus, they'll have some merch in there for sale. Plus, you're going to get a gift each day from the Alumni Association team. And the first day you check in, you get a special little, I think we're going to do, I don't know, sun special. But you'll be allowed into that air-conditioned, nice building. And then when you're done with that, you'll be let right out the back into the venue. How badass is that? And uh, it's going to be awesome. Plus, we got, I mean, I'll tell you what, y'all. Plus, the whole package with a Letterman's jacket, hat t-shirt a, a, a very special Chris Underwood metal card I mean it's gonna be metal it's gonna have your name on it your number or your whatever number you are and all your goodies uh, when you join should so be like three of 21 all of that stuff so the ultimate package plus you get that last time 20% off you're gonna get allowed get emails saying you can buy these tickets first things like that as they come up the mega package with jacket, hat, t shirt, koozie, card, sticker. I don't know what else the hell's in there. A lot of stuff. It's gonna be 150 bucks. And we all know those Letterman jackets usually are 250 and up. And you'll have a special patch on the front. Or not patch, what do they call those, mate? Like they have on the Letterman jacket. And you got your letter. And then on the back, it'll have the big Highway 30 Alumni Association. So, uh, and I'm talking big. Um, and uh, then you'll have the opportunity to pick a flat bill hat or a regular hat and some other little things. And you'll get items that only you can get by being an alumni member. Rob Rudolph said, I'm in as alumni. John yes. Daniel said, sign me up. Yep. So these are going to go. So as soon as those come on March 5th, you'll be able to get on, uh, get your stuff ordered, look at the different packages. But I'm telling you. And then they're going to offer, and then throughout the years, we'll have different patches that you can add to those jackets. Uh, we're super excited about that. We've teamed up with J3, um, who uh, is your Jocelyn's rep here in the Valley. And, uh, and then uh, got some other people helping out, getting us some items, uh, some local vendors. And it's going to be badass, y'all. I'm telling you, badass. Joel Wright said, big boy sizes? Absolutely, Joel. I've got <laughs> one coming, so there's one for you. You can order, it'll have a size list and they go all, hell, they build them for college football players. So we're going to be good. We're going to be good, my friend. Tink said, shut up and take my money. Ha ha ha. Yes. And uh, so anyway, those of me be watching for that. Uh, it'll be released and then everybody can get signed up. Now we'll do sign ups from like March 5th through the end of on the first go round. Then we'll get all the gear ordered and it'll be here it's probably going to take six to eight weeks for those jackets i'm not going to lie to you on that but they'll be in because they're custom made to you they're your size if you want your name put on them you can add you can do some add-ons that isn't in the 150 but if you want your name or different thing you can get some different things to put on them so it is going to be badass is all i'm going to tell you mark canham said i'm in mark i know mark mark don't worry i've already got to talk to you about getting your special one 
So anyway, y'all, and Mark's got us some, uh, some koozies coming for the birthday party. Awesome. Um, so we're super excited about that. Speaking of the birthday party, has anybody, we already had um, Low Down Drifters, Ellie Mae, as a band, we're working on that as long as she can borrow the Low Down Drifters, as long as the drum set thing works out. Um, we've got uh, Sage, and we've got Caden, right? Mm -hmm. Then... My buddies, the Lowdown Directors, called me and said, Hey, you know, uh, you've heard of Hellbound Glory, haven't you? And I said, Absolutely. I go, Hell yeah, that's what I said, huh, actually? Mm -hmm. And they said, You know, the lead singer of that, Le Leroy Virgil, lead singer of Hellbound Glory, is going to be out on the road with them right there. I said, You mind if he gets up and sings some songs? Now, if you have not listened to Hellbound Glory and they're tied in with Shooter Jennings and some other people, you need to go. Li they are amazing. And, Le and Leroy is going to be. Here at the pre-birthday party, the be your both days. What he's gonna do? We're gonna get him up on stage, do maybe a 35 minute somewhere in there on the pre-party. Okay. I have a feeling we just you know how tight takes get on at the regular birthday party. He may get up and do something with the lowdown, uh, but uh, just a little extra special something for you. Now. Uh, on getting on alumni, on getting on, the, and you can, you get the basic alumni, you get the 20%, you get the fast, you get those things, plus you can spend the one and get everything, which I'm telling you is a hell of a value. I, I, we're treating you right, and it's going to be awesome, yes. Fairfield said, sweet, can never have enough Highway 30 gear. Absolutely, Fairfield, absolutely, Spe plus we're working on some bomber style jackets too in the works from Jostin, so uh, That'll be kind of a cool something too, and they'll be one of a kinds. And as an alumni member, you will get that info first. See where this is going. Sponsors get an email of your sponsor. Alumni is going to get special stuff, and then the, there'll be the regular email. So there's there's reasons to do this. Get on the email list, and we're going to take care of y'all. Um, so um, exciting things. Yes. Austin English just jumped on. Said, "Hey, hey, everybody! Hey, Happy hey. Sunday!" I'll tell you what, if you didn't see there, Austin's giving away saying you'll need to go on the, on his page and he's giving away a package if you go look uh, uh, if you like him or something on Spotify. You'll have to go when he went live on Wednesday, Tuesday, one day, day last week. And actually in that package are, uh, that he's giving away, we're going to give away, there are two packages, we're going to give away a Highway 30 hat in each one of those packages. So uh, super cool on that. And once again, it is hap happy Cole Wetzel Day. And you're not a real Cole Wetzel fan if you don't know what Cole the Wetzel significance of February 28, 2016. There you go. And it's Dre's birthday. So I think there's something to do with both of them. Anyway, go, mate. You had somebody else. Kevin Adams asked, to get into the camping area, do you have to have tickets to the shows? Well, you, Kevin, you, you do have to. Are you, you mean just to stop and say hi to somebody? Um, I don't quite understand that question. The camping area, you do have to camp there. Um, the camping's all sold to people with, that have tickets. But if you're stopping in to say hi to somebody, I mean, I'm not going to tell you absolutely no, but there's very limited parking. And so I, I don't know if that's the answer you're looking for. But yes, everybody that's there... Um, is a ticket at Highway 30 or have something to do with the truck show. Now that could be a possibility too on a camping spot because we are going to have a semi truck show this year too uh, in an area that we've never used before. The main parking for the fairground. So I, I don't know. Uh, maybe Kevin, send me a um, what do we want to uh, a PM to Highway 30 on that question so we can help you get that figured out, my friend. Because I'm kind of. He said right on. That's what I needed to know, boss. Much appreciated. Perfect. Okay. I just want to make sure that's okay. But, uh, yeah, absolutely. If you got a visitor coming in, yeah, they can come visit. Completely understand that. Um, lots of cool, lots of cool, cool things coming. So the pop-up show, March 26th, Sam Riggs, that's going to go super fast. Alumni Association, you'll hear about more about it tomorrow. And like I say, it's going to have cool things. Your fast pass to get you in. Uh, get you a special check-in area, get you into the venue faster, uh, get you in early on each day for a uh, into the Alumni Association building where there'll be some refreshments and one band a day or performer a day 
that'll be in there doing a meet and greet for y'all and you'll have a special gift you get each day a different one and uh, you get your special pat well i think that's going to happen uh, but you'll have that card that'll get you through and a special check-in at the front gate it'll be marked for highway 30 alumni members uh the birthday party bash uh sold out the the saturday we're doing a pre-party get on there tickets are going fast on that we rearranged some things where we opened up some tables it was a little confusing um our, our, our great team but they thought we were on tables just like we had at the bash or the benefit uh the pre-party we want to open more of those up as singles you know so you can be you can get clear up front with a couple things so uh get on and check that out and I'll tell you what, y'all, super cool things coming. Uh, I'm going to go see JP Mains today, amazing today, and maybe have some bit, little bit of video or something from there as I'm picking some really cool shit up from him. And uh, we're excited, yes. Austin English said, the live was Wednesday, and the love we received from our Idaho family has been incredible. Thanks so much for tuning in. We'll be doing it again soon. Awesome. So there you go. So go look at that, and there's a contest on there for a couple of... Uh, Swag packages that will include a Highway 30 Music Fest uh, pack. So, um, I think there's a lot of envelope kicks out there making. Oh, and I guess I should tell, and this, uh, you're getting it first, but since it is uh, Cole Wetzel Day, uh, Friday, a fish Friday tickets, after looking at what happened last night and what's happened this morning, is officially on, should we say very low? Mm -hmm. Very low. So there's your warning uh, that'll get put on the pages, but Friday only and Friday, Saturdays are alert, on alert, low alert. and the whole four days is alert, just, alert, yes, alert. is on alert as it is getting <laughs> close, you all. And I get it, I get it that you guys are going, it's, it's this far out, but you can still get on and you can buy, um, you can use the payment plan still. Uh, so. It shortens up the closer it gets. But get on there. I think it's down to three payments right now. It could be wrong. It could be right. March, whatever. So get on there and go on there and check that out. And um, but get those tickets. If and once I'm telling you what, once the Friday only, you know that day is sold out. If it's Friday only, then you're gonna have to buy a Friday Saturday, and they're gonna be gone. Then it's a three day, four day. Just buy the dang four day. It's a hell of a deal. Come all week. And have a great time. That's my opinion. Um, so anyway, anything else you want to put in, May? No, nope, we're good. Um, so revamp a little bit. Happy birthday, all those that are having birthdays. Craig Wren, Shane Rock, Keaton Wright, Scott Nichols, John Daniels, Molly Hamilton, and Drake. Uh, Sam Pop-Up Show, March 26th. Those tickets will probably go on sale this week. I'm thinking maybe around the 3rd. Um, tables, and it is, it is kid-friendly, but they do have to be ticketed. Uh, this is one of those shows where we're very limited seats. It's not like Highway 30 or 12 and under free. This, they have to be ticketed and buy the ticket. And it's a regular price ticket. I, I apologize about that, but it's the only way we can make these pop-up shows work. Uh, and since we're on that, yes, yes, Virginia, there is a sound clause. And I do have some other pop-up shows in the works. And they are very amazing women singers, a couple of them. Uh, Michael Madden said, can't wait. Awesome. Can't wait to see you, Michael. Uh, congratulations on what you're all your house sales. You've been kicking it. That's awesome. Um, Rob Rudolph said, can't go wrong with the four day. No, can't go wrong with that four day. Joel said, I'm set all four days. Absolutely. So, do we ever get Joel's hat shipped? We got to get that. <laughs> Joel, we got to get your hat. Oh my gosh, Joel. You got to remind uh, us. Scott Trappin said, I imagine the fairgrounds would let us bring in a trailer for the birthday party weekend. Yes, yes, yes. You can get a hold of John, but I don't think there's any, just let Pitts know, but I don't think there's going to be power, but I don't think there's going to be any, I don't think the water will be turned on by then. Uh, over at the washout zone, they may have the water on, but that's about the only place. I don't know any of the, I don't know. I could be wrong. We'll find out for sure. We'll find out for sure and let everybody know. We're planning on taking a trailer there too, and it's going to be all weekend for everybody going Friday and Saturday. So it'd be great to have a trailer and we can just have some fun and yeah, find a place to park and make this happen. Uh, so pop up show tickets coming up this week, alumni association coming up this week, and get your tickets to the pre birthday party bash. Um, other than that, I think we've got it all under control. Yep. Anything else we're supposed to be talking about? Well, if not, I don't I think, think so. 
So, Jaylene said all set for my Saturday tickets. Who's that? Jaylene. Jaylene, awesome. Saturday Can't wait to see you. Saturday, is, gonna come Saturday is going to be a every day. It's going to be awesome. And we can't thank you all enough for uh, buying the tickets, supporting us, becoming part of the Highway 30 Music Fest family. Um, also, uh, got some new sponsors that have been talking to people want to sponsor. Uh, we still have some sponsorships available. Those come with a, a great ticket package, I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. So if you're thinking of that, uh, you may look into that too. Become a sponsor and you get a ticket package with that. Uh, but anyway, that being said, we're going to clock off here. we got to get ready and go ahead. What do you guys say? If you don't get your tickets, the shark is going to come for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's true. Well, no. If you don't get your tickets, you may not get any. So you want to get them. And we're so blessed and thank you all so, so much for buying those tickets and supporting us. Uh, the Highway 30 Music Fest family is one of the greatest families in the world. And we're so blessed to be part of that. And we can't thank each and every one of you enough for all you do for us. Because without you all, without you fans, the bands, the sponsors, the volunteers, everybody that makes up this thing we call the Highway 30 Music Fest family, uh, we couldn't do it. And we are so grateful for y'all. A couple things. Uh, Joel said got his tickets for the Friday pre-party. Awesome. Lacey said love you guys. Love you. Grayson Stone said Asher Shark do 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 oh, do. Don't start that song. <laughs> Dang old Grayson. Thanks, Grayson. Uh, I'll also be uh, also be watching. Now I know next. Wait, I do have one more thing. Next Saturday. Are we going to be at the Landmark? Yes. So next Saturday at the Landmark, Cliff Miller Music will be playing. He'll be back again. We've already got a big table over there, and we possibly could get some more, but I think the 16 we've got or 18 we've got is filling up. Mm -hmm. But let's all meet over in uh, Hastington at the Landmark next Saturday, and uh, Drew will clip on. But get, get reservations, because I think it's going to sell out, y'all. And they're not no cover. You just got to get a table. Got to get a table. So, uh, might want to do that, and we'll see y'all there. Yes. Joel said, have a great week. Stay safe. Yes, you too, Joel. All right, y'all. Thank you, each and every one of you, for all you do. And that being said, God, God bless. bless. Take, Take care. care. See y'all real soon. Bye. Bye.